What if I told you that it might be the end of Brookhaven? Some time ago, they were speculating that the game would end on the 1st of September. That date has passed, and as you can see, the game wasn't deleted. But according to this YouTuber, the game could be deleted at any time now. To explain this, she goes to Mr. Brookhaven's profile, which would be the old owner of the town. In his creation, she finds a game that as she enters, she finds some kind of Brookhaven, but bizarre, there's a lot more creepy stuff in there. And in this school's old white Whiteboard, it says that Brookhaven will be cursed on the 23rd of October. That's kind of scary. I hope it's not true. There's even a message telling us to be careful that day. Now she's going into another game of his. And dude, it's literally Brookhaven, but all the players are down on the ground. So of course, I'm gonna go into that map and see if that's true. To start, we should go look in the search bar for Mr. Brookhaven. This is the one we're looking for. I guess this is the actual Mr. Brookhaven profile. And if we go into his creation, we should find it here. Wait, content deleted? Indeed, guys. The game that was deleted was the one she was talking about. So sadly, we won't be able to play it. But if we go lower into his profile, we'll see that he has only one friend, which is this guy. And if you pay attention to the name, it's October the 30th, 2023. As I am recording this video, we are in October, right at the start of the month. So, would that be a message for us? Why don't we try and look at his creations too? Looks like he's got one. His very own place. If we go look for the map's info, it was created on the 3rd of October, 2023. Like two days ago. I may even be the first YouTuber to talk about this. I haven't seen it anywhere else. But anyways, let's get into it and see if there's anything of note. Here we are inside of it. But it seems like this is just the tutorial map for Roblox. Whenever you try to create a map, it normally gives you this one to test it. It's basically the default Roblox map. There's a chest in here though. Looks like we got a lantern. That's kinda cool. We're not really gonna need that since it's pretty bright out still. So it doesn't make too much sense for it to be in the game. Over this way we have this whole mountain. In this place there's this little hole we can find. Okay, now we're gonna need that lantern we got. To be honest, that's probably exactly why they left this lantern for us. We just found another one of these chests. What's inside this thing? It's a coil? Well, that can be useful. This spring looking thing is what we call a speed coil. It helps us go a lot faster. I'm really not sure if Mr. Brookhaven put this into the map. Or maybe the map just had that in it already. Who knows? Whoa! Wait, I think I found another hole. Where is this even taking us? All right, what do we have here? Another chest? This time it gave us an invisibility cape? Is this real? Let's try it out and see if it works then. Dude, we actually disappeared. Now I'm invisible man. You won't see me coming. Let's stop this madness and see if we can find any other chest. Looks like this is a lot hotter. There's even lava around. You're kidding. There's actually another chest. This time we got some sort of controller? Is it like a GPS system? What happens if I click on it? Wait a minute. I think this is actually some sort of teleporter. That's so cool. We got all those things and we can now even teleport around. Can we go to the end of it there? Okay, that was fast. Like in a few seconds, really easily too. But that's all there is in this place. Nothing of note really. In this video, we see some people using cheats in the game. This literally lets this guy destroy anything he wants in the whole town of Brookhaven. He's really not concerned. Explodes the town hall. The fire station. Nothing is out of the question. Using cheats like that guy is completely against the rules of the game. But this one right here actually lets us destroy the whole town like that. When I said destroy the whole town, I wasn't kidding. We can literally get these huge bombs on the ground. And they are nothing less than atomic nukes. We got a cannon as well as the big nuke. To start, why don't we test it on that guy right there? My dude, be careful as I am dangerous. Oh gosh. That was even worse than I thought. Most of the spawn is gone now. I'll use it again. Take that. This is such a fun weapon. I'm really liking this. Why don't we try this yellow nuke now? It seems pretty damn strong. So let's test it on Brooks Diner. I'll put a bunch of these around. Now we need to run. And real fast. Oh gosh. 
That didn't work out for me. Dude, I can't even spawn anymore. Look at the size of that thing. There's so many explosions going around after that. Let's see how much it was damaged. Wait, where's the damage? This just looks normal. Apparently, all that the bomb destroys are the players that are inside. So instead of using it, we'll use the cannon we did before. All right, three, two, one, go. Oh gosh, it even got to me. But now, as you can see, Brooks Diner is really destroyed now. I logged into another fake Brookhaven, which also has something to do with destruction. We started with about four items. One of them is this really strong rocket launcher. This one is probably the call and a bomb strike. That yellow nuke we used before and then we got a jetpack, so it's easier to get away from those giant explosions. It's really fun too! We even got some houses in here, so why don't we try them out on them? Good to test out the damage we can deal. I guess we can start with the rocket launcher, but before doing this house destruction. Let me get a car. This white truck right here is gonna see something. We'll test it on it. Take that. Oh gosh. It actually was destroyed. Look at its parts going down. The fire doesn't want to stop as well. This is too much. Now we'll test on something different. In this case, a horse. I'm sorry, horsey. You're our test subject today. You're gonna be ground zero for this nuke. So let's make a run for it. We gotta be fast or we're gonna end with it too. Oh yeah, the jetpack. I'll just use it. I think right here is good. Oh gosh. Okay, we got it. Look at the thing we dropped on the horse. Poor little thing. It seems to have been real strong. I'll come closer and see how the horse ended up. The smoke is going away, but the horse should have been right there. Did it just disappear? Please give some Fs in the comments for horsey. Now I want to see this airstrike, and I want to use it in a house. I'm not sure how it works, so I'll come close and try it out. All right, I think we targeted it. Something should come in a moment. Dude, why did nothing drop on that house? Let's try it again. You see that I targeted it, but nothing has happened at all. Well, use the rocket launcher on it then. It takes a bit long to get there, but the damage is good. I'll even send another one their way. We'll get some nukes around just for good measure. Now we need to make a run for it. This is really dangerous. Damn, everything is starting to blow up. Oh gosh, it even got me. I logged into another one, and in this one we don't even have to do a thing. It's already destroyed. You can see all these abandoned cars on the streets, which is just sad. This one's basically in an apocalypse, so there's even zombies going around. Look at him go. Wait, we got guns? You're kidding. I'll grab them all. Now we just have to test them out. See those zombies there? Take that. Okay, this one doesn't seem to work right now. So I'll use this one. Leave that bacon hair alone. Why are these guns so weak? They don't end the zombies. Oh wait, I think I got one. I think the lava one is just really strong. So it's hard to finish him. Take that to you weird zombie. One of them is just sitting on the swing. Are you having fun? Well, you're gonna eat lead. Dude, what just happened in there? Did the plane just crash into that building? That's so crazy. Here we have a house and their garage looks quite a bit dirty. Was someone trying to get in? Not really sure, but can we go into it? Looks like we can't because it's locked up. What about from the backyard? There's gotta be a way, but we still can't get into it. We're locked in the yard. Anyways, guys, there's quite a few weird Roblox games around. Those are only some of them. They can still be pretty fun though, but that's that's gonna have to be it for today. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like on the video and comment down below what other games you want to see me play next. Make sure to watch one of the videos on screen right now. They won't end, they're just starting. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel for even more Roblox goodness. Have a good one!